तो नमस्कार ग्लोबल ज्ञान चैनल पे आपका स्वागत है साथियों आज का जो टॉपिक है वो रेलवे डिपार्टमेंटल एग्जाम के तहत जो बेलफेयर इंस्पेक्टर हैं उससे रिलेटेड है तो आइए क्वेश्चंस की ओर देखते हैं एंड क्वेश्चन नंबर वन है हु ऑथराइज आई आर ई सी और आई आर ई एम तो इसका करेक्ट आंसर है ऑप्शन नंबर ए सेक्रेटरी रेलवे बोर्ड आइए क्वेश्चन नंबर टू की ओर चलते हैं एंड क्वेश्चन नंबर टू है हु इज द ऑथोरिटी टू इंटरप्रिट द रूल्स गिवेन इन आई आर ई सी और आई आर ई एम आंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर बी प्रेसिडेंट ऑफ इंडिया हु प्रेसिडेंट ऑफ इंडिया लेट इज कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री एंड क्वेश्चन इज फुल फॉर्म ऑफ आई आर एस ई ई आंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर डी इंडियन रेलवे सर्विस ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियर वट इंडियन रेलवे सर्विस ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियर लेट इज कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर एंड क्वेश्चन इज डेफिनेशन ऑफ गजेड पोस्ट हैज ऑप्शन नंबर सी अपॉइंटमेंट इज मेड बाई नोटिफिकेशन इन गेस्टेड ऑफ इंडिया आंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर सी लेट इज कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव एंड क्वेश्चन इज सुपर न्यूमेरी द पोस्ट इज जनरली क्रिएटेड टू ए स्पेसिफिक टाइम पीरियड ऑप्शन विल बी बी लेट एस कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स एंड क्वेश्चन इज इन रेलवे पावर टू मेक रूल्स फॉर ग्रेड सी एंड ग्रेड डी स्टाफ लाइज विथ आंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर ए रेलवे बोर्ड लेट एस कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवन एंड क्वेश्चन इज प्लेसमेंट कमिटी इज फॉर्म फॉर ट्रांसफर और पोस्टिंग आंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर बी लेट एस कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर एट एंड क्वेश्चन इज हु हैज द पावर टू प्रोमोट ग्रेड सी स्टाफ टू ग्रेड बी ऑफिसर पोस्ट जनरल मैनेजर मीन्स जी एम आंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर सी लेट एस कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन एंड क्वेश्चन इज फुल फॉर्म ऑफ एल डी सी ई लिमिटेड डिपार्टमेंटल कंपिटिटिव एग्जामिनेशन आंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर बी व्हाट लिमिटेड डिपार्टमेंटल कंपिटिटिव एग्जामिनेशन एल डी सी ई लेटस कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर टेन एंड क्वेश्चन इज पीपल होल्डिंग नेशनलिटी ऑफ विच कंट्रीज आर एलिजिबल टू अप्लाई फॉर इंडियन रेलवे सर्विसेस आंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर डी इंडिया नेपाल भूटान तिब्बतन रिफ्यूजीज एंड पी आई ओ एज ऑफ सर्टेन अदर कंट्रीज Let us come to the question number eleven. And question is: Following word is not used in oath of allegiance. Answer will be option number B. Prompt promptness. Let us come to the question number twelve. And question is: Article three one one is related to D A R. Answer will be option number A. Let us come to the question number thirteen. And question is. अप्रेंटिस अदर देन गवर्नमेंट बाई अप्रेंटिस एक्ट 1961 सिक्सटी वन एक्सेप्ट एज अदर वॉइस प्रोवाइडेड इन हिज सर्विस एग्रीमेंट हिज सर्विस शैल बी लिएबल टू टर्मिनेशन ऑन नोटिस ऑफ वन वीक आंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर सी लेट एस कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टीन एंड क्वेश्चन इज वॉट इज द फुल फॉर्म ऑफ एम डी डी टी आई मीन्स मल्टी disciplinary divisional training institute answer will be option number d let us come to the question number 15 and question is all expenditure from the staff benefit fund shall be authorized by the committee or by a sub committee duly appoint appointment under the provisions of rule of irec volume 1 rules 808 answer will be option number b let us come to the question number 16 and question is a member of sbf committee shall hold office for one year unless he is removed by the general manager or resigns but shall be able for renomination or reelection answer will be option number c one year let us come to the question number 17 and question is lay off means failure or refusal or inability of an employee on account of shortage of coal power or raw materials to give 
employment to a workman answer will be option number d let us come to the question number 18 and question is canteen is required to be provided and maintained by occupier for the use of workers wherein more than days workers are ordinarily employed answer will be option number c 250 let us come to the question number 19 and question is the primary purpose of employee safety program is to preserve the employees then answer will be option number a mental health option number b physical health option number c emotional health means all of the above answer will be option number d let us come to the question number 20 and the question is a railway servant whose employment is intensive or constitute continuous continuous shall be granted a weekly rest of not less than days consecutive hours means 30 30 hours answer will be option number d let us come to the question number 21 and question is in each station or other establishments a copy of chapter of the act and hw and pr 2005 in english hindi and local language was displayed in a conspicuous place answer will be option number c 14 let us come to the question number 22 and question is minimum basis act is not applied to the staff answer will be option number c employ in the construction or maintenance of permanent bay let us come to the question number 23 and question is under which rule prescribed in the railway service conduct rules 1966 a railway servant is prohibited from becoming a member of political party answer will be option number d rule 5 let us come to the question number 24 and question is if a railway servant has a weld e o l and or some period of absent is treated as dies none during previous half year the credit shall be reduced by 1 by 10th or the period of such eol and or dies none subject to a maximum of dash days means 15 days answer will be option number a let us come to the question number 25 and question is when the first cat has been established 1 11 1985 first of november 1985 is the correct answer let us come to the question number 26 and question is group b gusted officer get first class a duty pass and it is true it is true let us come to the question number 27 and question is which of the following is not a method for fixing minimum wages under the minimum wages act 1948 answer will be option number c bargaining method let us come to the question number 28 and question is which is the which is the full form of slp means a special leave petition what a special leave petition option number a let us come to the question number 29 and question is who is the secretary of central staff benefit fund committee answer will be option number c dip to dip t cpo or welfare let us come to the question number 30 and question is where is training classroom based of indian railway personal service officer held answer will be barodra gujarat let us come to the question number 31 and question is anticipated vacancies for next month are considered for non-selection post answer will be option number b 12 let us come to the question number 32 and question is can a removed railway employee participate in the meeting of sbf committee means no let us come to the question number 33 and question is name of the online grievance read readdress machinery for railways nivaran option number a nivaran let us come to the question number 34 and question is the minimum wages as fixed under the minimum wages act 1948 must be revised at least once in five years option number c let us come to the question number 35 and question is 
minimum number of members required to form a selection board is answer will be option number b 3 let us come to the question number 36 and question hai rajya bhasha ke protsahan ke liye inme se kaun si yojana ya puraskar ghoshit kiye gaye hain to iska answer ho jayega pravin pravodh aur pragya matlab total ka total ek do aur teen iska answer ho jayega let us come to the question number 37 and question is under the minimum wage act which of the following cannot be appointed by the ap appropriate government by notification under the official gazette gadget for deciding claims arising out of payment of less than the minimum rates of wage answer will be option number d any officer not less than the rank of district magistrate let us come to the question number 38 and question is staff failing in continuous category are allowed days hours of rest every week to 30 hours of rest every week answer will be option number c let us come to the question number 39 and question is under the child labor prohibition and regulation act 1986 a child is one who has not completed his Fourteen years. Answer will be option number D. Fourteen years. Let us come to the question number forty. And question is: Joining time for more than thousand kilometer, but less than two thousand kilometer is twelve days. Answer will be option number C. Let us come to the question number forty-one. And question is: Running allowance is described. In which chapter of IREM? Answer will be option number B, 9. Let us come to the question number 42. And question is, retention of railway quarter in case of death is permissible for months 24, means 2 years. Let us come to the question number 43. And question is, general manager has the power the grant days years of hospital leave to railway servant means unlimited answer will be unlimited question number 44 full form of hrms human resource management system what human resource management system option number a let us come to the question number 45 and question is what is the maximum percentage of commutation of pension answer will be option number a 40 let us come to the question number 46 and question is how much money is reserved for women empower, empowerment through SBF? Answer will be 23% option number D. Let us come to the question number 47 and question is under CGA the minimum required for other than widow educational qualification for getting a group c post is 12th option number b let us come to the question number 48 and question is ta comes under income tax net answer will be option number b not in any situation what ta comes under income tax net not in any situation let us come to the question number 49 and question is function of sf 14 is to give charge sheet to retired railway servant option number b let us come to the question number 50 and question is which of the following legislation apply to unorganized sector workers in india and then option number a is minimum wage act Option number B, Child Labor Prohibition and Regulation Act 1986. Option number C, Contract Labor Regulation and Evolution Act 1970. Means all of the above answer will be option number D. Let us come to the question number 51 and the question is, Raj Bhasha Adhiniyam 1963 kab parit hua? To 10 May 1963 ko BBI question. Sathiyo, ye bohat BBI question hai. क्योंकि कई बार ये क्वेश्चन आ चुके हैं। Let us come to the question number fifty two and question is in which year child in which year did the payment of wages 
एक्ट कम इन टू फोर्स ट्वेंटी थर्ड ऑफ अप्रिल नाइनटीन थर्टी सिक्स आंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर सी लेट इस कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर फिफ्टी थ्री एंड क्वेश्चन इज स्टाफ इन एक्सक्लूडेड कैटेगरी आर इलिजिबल फॉर एन डी ए इन करेक्ट लेट इस कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर फिफ्टी फोर आयुर्वेदिक और होम्योपैथी फिजिशियन हु वर्क फॉर फोर आवर्स एवरी डे विल बी पेड आर एस नाइन थाउजेंड एज ऑनोरेरियम इन करेक्ट Let us come to the question number fifty-five. And question is: As per railway services liberalised leave rules, nineteen forty-nine, casual leave can be followed by quarantine leave. Option number D is the correct answer. Let us come to the question number fifty-six. And question is: The Child Labour Prohibition and Regulation Act, nineteen eighty-six, is an example of. protective labor legislation answer will be option number b let us come to the question number 57 and question is how many school check passes can be issued in a year answer will be option number d 3 let us come to the question number 58 and question is the special provision provisions relating to lay off retrenchment and closed as given under the industrial disputes act 1947 apply to those establishments where at least 100 workers are employed answer will be option number a let us come to the question number 59 and question is manpower planning facilities option number a promotion at right time Option number B, surrender of posts. Option number C, recruitment. Answer will be all of A. Bhav. Let us come to the question number sixty. And question is, financial assistance from railway ministers, welfare and relief fund is granted only for sickness of rail railway men or their dependents. Incorrect. Let us come to the question number sixty-one. And question is, in which se kaun se raj sankshachit Pradesh se raj bhasha ke adhiniyam anusar ka chhatr ke andar nahi aata hai. To Maharashtra iske tahat nahi aata hai. Question phir se padhi in which se kaun sa sang raj sankshachit Pradesh raj bhasha ke adhiniyam anusar ka ke chhatr me nahi aata hai. To Maharashtra nahi aata hai. Let us come to the question number sixty-two. And question is: Concession of education assistant, rem reimbursement of retuition fees, and hostel subsidy will be available up to this number of children. Means two. Two is correct answer. Two children only. Question number sixty-three is: First come, last go. And last come first go is the principle of detachment. Answer will be option number C. Let us come to the question number sixty-four. And question is: Gusted railway servants can become member of consumer cooperative society, but cannot be elected as office bearers. Give your views on this. They can be both. There is no restriction. Answer will be option number D. Let us come to the question number sixty-five. And question is the total amount of deductions from wages of employees should not exceed percent is fifty percent is the correct answer. Let us come to the question number sixty-six. And question is full form of P R E M means participation of railway employees in management. What? Participation of railway employees in management. Let us come to the question number sixty-seven. And question is, which of the which of these is the purpose of recruitment? Answer will be option number B. Selecting right person for the right job. What? Selecting right person for the right job. Let us come to the question number sixty-six. And question is, under SBF scheme, amount reserved for giving. 
scholarship for technical education to children of SC employees is 15%. Answer will be option number A. Let us come to the question number 69 and question is the disciplinary authority can never act as inquiry officer. Give your views. Incorrect. Let us come to the question number 70 and question is the workmen's compensation act 1923, the maternity benefit act 1965 and the employees state insurance act 1948 is if the workmen's compensation act and the maternity benefit act are applicable the employees estate insurance act is not applicable let us come to the question number 71 and question is as per 7th cpc what is the percentage of non practicing pra practicing allowance 20 percent answer will be option number c let us come to the question number 72 and question is casual labor can get benefit of MSCP incorrect question number 73 when the people involved in the process comprehend unlikable results from their interactions with the involvement it is specifically called anticipatory stress answer will be option number b let us come to the question number 74 and question is dcrg of retired employee is stopped till he vacates the quarter correct answer will be option number a let us come to the question number 75 and question is under workmen compensation Act 1923, which of the following are considered as dependent of deceased workmen for the purpose of paying compensation? Answer will be all of the above. 1, 2, 3, 4. A, well, first is a minor brother or, or an unmarried sister or a widow sister. Uh, uh, Number 2, a widow daughter-in-law. Number three, a minor child of a pre-deceased son. Number four, a minor child of a pre-deceased daughter where no parent of the child is alive. Number five, a paternal grandparent if no parent of the workman is alive. Let us come to the question number 76 and question is, how many times PNM meeting are organized in a year at divisional level? 6. Answer will be option number B. Let us come to the question number 77 and question is study leave is counted as service for the purpose of granting increment? Yes. Let us come to the question number 78 and question is Choose the correct option where no workmen shall go on a strike in breach of contract and no employees, employer of any such workmen shall declare a lockout during. Answer will be all of the above. Option number A. The pendency of cancellation proceeding before award and seven days after the conclusion of such proceedings option number b the pendency of proceeding before labor court tribunal or national tribunal and two months after the conclusion of such proceedings option number c during any period in which a settlement of award or award is in operation is respect of any of the matters covered by the settlement of award means all of the above correct answer तो आइए क्वेश्चन नंबर 79 को देखते हैं एंड क्वेश्चन है संसद में प्रयोग होने वाली भाषा का प्रावधान संविधान के किस अनुच्छेद में किया गया है तो अनुच्छेद 120 लेट अस कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर 80 एंड क्वेश्चन इज which form is issued for appointment of inquiry officer under DAR rules? SF7. Question number 81 is, will a workman be entitled 
to compensation if he does not present himself for work at all establishment at the appointment time during normal working hours at least once a day no question number 82 is the present wage shilling per month for the purpose of the payment of wages act 1936 is 18000 rupees uh, option will be c let us come to the question number 83 and question is which section of the child labor prohibition and regulation act 1986 defines the terms child answer will be option number c section 2 ka 2 let us come to the question number 84 and question is which of the following is not included under the definition of wage given under the payment of wage act 1936 gratuity option will be d let us come to the question number 85 and question is as per factories act adult means a person who has completed des years of age 18 years of age let us come to the question number 86 and question is the president of india makes dr rules in exercise of the power conferred by the pro proviso so of article dash of the constitution of india article 311 let us come to the question number 87 and question is communication from subordinate subordinate of dinate to superior is called upward communication answer will be option number c let us come to the question number 88 and question is grade d staff with gp 1800 are entitled to which type of quarter answer will be option number b type 1 let us come to the question number 89 and question is which of the following is machinery for settlement of industrial disputes answer will be option number c industrial tribunal let us come to the question number 90 and question is das is a scientific and systematic effort to modify the characteristics of an employee's job job redesign answer will be option number a let us come to the question number 91 and question is assertion a provisions of employees compensation act and maternity benefit act do not apply to all industries reason are employees compensation act is a comprehensive social security legislation answer will be a is wrong but r is right answer will be option number a let us come to the question number 92 and question is the children education allowance per day per child per year shall be rs rs 27000 answer will be option number b Let us come to the question number ninety three and question is who is the secretary of P N M meeting at railway board level? Deputy director E S T T. Answer will be option number C. Let us come to the question number ninety four and question is which of the following is an illegal industrial acting as per Industrial Dispute Act? Answer will be option number D. Let us come to the question number ninety-five. And question is the maximum the compensation allowance which shall be granted to an employee who is removed from service is days of compensation pension to by third. Answer will be option number C. Let us come to the question number ninety-six. And question is the days of railway production units have been appointed as occupiers. of the respective units in terms of the provisions of the factories ad 1948 mc23 answer will be option number c chief mechanical engineer or cwm let us come to the question number 97 and question is tata motors refused to accept an order of 1000 truck placed by pakistan this is an example of ethics answer will be option number a let us come to the question number 98 and question number a. question is memorandum 
का हिंदी अनुवादन क्या है तो ज्ञापन क्वेश्चन नंबर 99 है एज रिलैक्सेशन फॉर ओवीसी कैंडिडेट्स फॉर रिक्रूटमेंट इन गवर्नमेंट सर्विसेज थ्री इयर्स आंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर ए लेट इज कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर हंड्रेड एंड क्वेश्चन इज एज पर फैक्ट्रीज एक्ट ए फैक्ट्री डज नॉट इंक्लूड विच अमॉन्ग द फॉलोइंग आंसर विल बी वन टू थ्री एंड फोर लेट एस कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर हंड्रेड एंड वन एंड क्वेश्चन इज एक्सेम्शन फॉर्म डिस्क्लोजर ऑफ इंफॉर्मेशन आर मैंशन इन विच सेक्शन ऑफ राइट टू इंफॉर्मेशन एक्ट सेक्शन एट आंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर बी लेट एस कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर हंड्रेड एंड टू एंड क्वेश्चन इज विच अमॉन्ग द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट रिलेटिंग टू लीडरशिप इज फल्स लीडरशिप इज बुजिम बुजिम आंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर सी Let us come to the question number hundred and three. And question is: Retired G R railway employees is charged R S dash for availing the facility of holiday home R S sixty. Answer will be option number A. Let us come to the question number hundred and four. And question is: Under the Child Labour Prohibition and Regulation Act nineteen eighty six, a child one who has not completes his Fourteen years. Answer will be option number D. Let us come to the question number hundred and five. Which sector of the Kendra Sarkar's Kare Shalaon me apas me sampark nimlikhit bhasha me hoga? So Hindi or English. Answer will be option number A. Let us come to the question number hundred and six. Orissa Raj kaun se sector me aata hai? So option number C hai. C sector me. Kaun se sector me? C sector me. Question number hundred and seven hai. The exhaustion. suffered by an individual due to continuous exposure to a stress causing situation is normally known as burnout let us come to the question number 108 kendriya hindi samiti ke adhyaksh kon hote hain to pradhan mantri ji let us come to the question number 109 nimlikhit mein se kaun sa rajya kha kshetra ke antargat aata hai to gujarat question number 110 hai राज्य भाषा के आधार पर देश को कितने क्षेत्रों में बांटा गया है तो चार क्षेत्रों में बांटा गया है साथियों आपको अगर यह वीडियो अच्छा लगा हो तो प्लीज़ हमें ज़रूर सब्सक्राइब करें लाइक करें शेयर करें कमेंट सेक्शन में जाकर अपने कमेंट में ये मेंशन करें कि नेक्स्ट वीडियो आपका कौन से टॉपिक से चाहिए वैसे साथियों हम हमारी कोशिश है कि मैं आपको वेस्ट से वेस्ट दूँ और आपका जो मिशन है आपका डिपार्टमेंटल एग्जाम में प्रमोशन के तौर पर आप आगे बढ़े तो निश्चित तौर पे हमारा ये विश रहेगा और हमारा ये कर्तव्य रहेगा कि मैं आपको बेहतर से बेहतर चीज़ को दूँ बहुत बहुत धन्यवाद नमस्कार